This music video that we're about to review shows you how the left wing has everything fucking backwards. Let's watch it, shall we? This is supposed to be like Antifa acting like Anonymous. They're hacking people to find out where they live so they can assault them. Why? Well, because people disagree with them. I guess you got to assault them, right? They claim to be against Nazis, but they do exactly as the fascist Nazis did. They use violence to silence those who disagree with them. Yes, that hat is supposed to represent Trump's Make America Great Again hat. You may not know this, but left-wingers believe that Trump supporters are actual Nazis. And that's precisely why they're hunting them down in this video. So they're obviously talking about how this guy is going to get knocked the fuck out and the punishment fits the crime. I mean, what's the worst thing a Trump supporter wants done? Uh, for a wall to be built? To keep out illegal immigrants? Not Mexicans, illegal immigrants. So, they're not even racist. And according to this video, what's the perfect punishment that fits that crime? Being attacked by the terrorist organization Antifa and almost killed by that organization. Seems a little bit extreme to me. It makes me want to make sure that they don't get any more control over the government because they seem as bad, if not worse, than actual Nazis. So, their best examples of right-wingers that are, that are a Nazi is Richard Spencer and, of course, Trump. But neither of them are not even close. So, the terrorist organization Antifa just found this dude's house. They're going to break into his house and assault him. And this video embraces that. This video embraces terrorism. Did you hear that? Speech is free, but it comes at a price. That's straight from the path saying, say something I dislike, I'm going to physically harm you. Who's the Nazis again? Who, who, who's the Nazis again? Oh yeah, us. The right wing of the Nazis, not the fucking radical left. I love how they use gun imagery to damn this guy to make him look like he's the bad guy. But... You know, the way I see it is he's just trying to defend his home from fucking terrorists. Which seems like a good idea because some leftist terrorists are about to enter his home right about now. But I have a feeling that they're trying to portray him as some racist that kills minorities for, you know, just being a different color. And I don't know any Trump supporters that do that, so that's one hell of a straw man. And you just got the fuck out! The punishment fits the crime! They're portraying Trump supporters as literal Nazis. I swear to God, the left couldn't be more dramatic. Oh my God. I mean, how funny is that? They portray somebody as innocent and as fucking harmless as Trump. Trump. As a literal Hitler. And, and that is, supporters are literal Nazis. You couldn't be more dramatic if you fucking tried. What makes you think that this is a But these Trump supporters aren't preaching hate. They just want to build a wall. They just disagree with you. And you want to beat the shit out of them for them disagreeing with you. You're the only one preaching hate. This video is literally supporting terrorism. Ah! 
Yeah, that's what you get for wanting people to get proper documentation to come into the country. That's it, boys, girls, and those who sexually identify as an M16. I'm Mr. Dapperton, and I'll catch you on the next episode. Don't forget to donate to my Patreon, you little bitch.